I keep going because I, I like to do the work. That's it. That's what happens. If you like your work, you get on. My name is Anthony Mancinelli. I started when I was 12 years old. I started and I've, I'm doing it, still doing it now, today at 105. I had six brothers and a sister, and my father was only making $25 a week. And I figured maybe I could take, do something to help out a little bit. So I got up far, I used to get up four o'clock in the morning to deliver morning papers. When I get through with morning papers, I come home, I had breakfast, and from then I went to school. After school, I delivered afternoon papers to make extra money. After the papers delivered, I went to the barber shop to learn the barber business to eight o'clock at night. And that was a routine every day. I didn't wait for anything, I just kept going. Somebody wanted to sell a barber shop. I went there and bought a barber shop out. I was uh, only 20 years old. I had my first barber shop. It was cheap in those days because your haircut is 15 cents and 10 cents for a shave. It was haircut and shave for 25 cents. And of course, different styles came. They come to a uh, time girls as well as boys used to get the same type of a haircut, what they used to call Buster Brown. It was just a haircut that you cut straight across, that's all. You know, all these little shave oh, the hair coming all around the face. They call that the pixie haircut. The longer hair, and they, I used to call it the shag haircut. I don't know if you know that or not. I've done that too. <laughs> they cut different now. They all, everyone wants it short, short. Everybody wants clippers or clippers, take it off. <laughs> My type is a nice, neat haircut, nice full haircut, short, but nice and full around. It gives them appearance. I cut my own hair. <laughs> I've been cutting my own hair for years. <laughs> well, I, I had a barber that, he gave me the worst haircut I ever had. I said, after that, I'm cutting my own hair. If you're gonna be a barber, be a good barber. Don't be, you know, halfway. Be a good barber. And you'll always make a living. Thank you. You don't have to worry. Never have to worry about anything.